Amy, ever since the midwife handed you over to me in hospital, I have felt so proud of you. It was an amazing feeling to hold you, my first newly born daughter. I remember your gorgeous green eyes. Hello, I can see it's going, is this? I can remember your gorgeous green eyes were looking straight at me. You never cried, just looked around the room, taking everything in. And it was Alex Burwell, actually, has a lot to do for this. Do you actually know who that girl is that you're speaking to on Facebook and you've been to Nando's with? I said, uh, no, I think she's just, you know, it's just a barmaid that brought me a pint a few weeks ago. I was like, well, uh, she kind of owns the place, so don't mess it up. I really enjoy coming back here, so, you know, play it cool. I think, you know, I think I'm doing okay. But, uh, I give you this ring in celebration of my love for you and as a pledge to respect you and grow with you the whole of my life. A big thank you really has to go to Irene for helping out with, with the speech. Uh, she's provided a couple of pictures for us. So the first being um, a baby pick a Luke. <laughs> I mean, come on. His first day at school. And she got me a picture of his first day of secondary school. <laughs> Luke, my friend, from behalf of me and Daryl and everybody else in the room, we would just like to say how proud we are of you. You've come through some struggles, hard times, and you've turned into a, such a fantastic guy. And by far, your greatest achievement in life has got to be that. Aww.